guys. All right, so let's go over the sponge block position from the guard. If you train jiu-jitsu, self-defense, Gracie jiu-jitsu, I'm sure you've done this position many times, but I'm gonna give you a couple details that will make it much more effective, okay? So, when I'm here, Tomas goes to punch, I turn away, my hand is ready for the headbutt, I eat the punch. Now, most people put their foot on the floor to slide the hip and get into this position. The problem is, when I put my foot on the floor, I'm disconnected from him. So if he's not losing his balance, I have nothing keeping his posture down for me to control him. He can move. So instead, when I'm ready, for, hold on, when he winds back and I'm ready, I'm raising my hip, guys. So when he punches, look, boom, I'm already on my side. My right hand's barely touching here, so the knee pops in, and now's the second detail. Instead of holding on here, and pinching, which is a great position. That's how I teach the beginners so they learn the control, okay? I'm gonna release this wrist and I'm gonna solely focus on being on my side with my chest towards the floor so all the weight projects to his head and this way keeping him from posturing. Once I'm in this position, I'm in a great place. I can use elbow strikes. I can control him by the wrist lock here, look. Okay, and another detail setup that I like is, let's walk a little, this, 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 just a little, right there, freeze. Is when he tries to posture, since I'm not grabbing the wrist, I have a lot of pressure though. He won't be able to explode up. As he's pushing up, I'm gonna use this foot right there. Oh, boom, he has no balance. Now instead of catching the triangle right away, which would allow him to face me, I rather here, Turn more on my side and keep my control, especially in a fight. Can use your elbows, can use the wrist, can catch the kimura. If he starts coming up, look, my foot is over his shoulder, my knee's pointing down, guys. When he starts coming up, my triangle's already set. Boom, lock. Be ready for the punch here. This is. Raise my hip, bring it across, and now. Instead of going here where he might be able to hit me or something else, a great detail on the fight triangle that my dad likes to do is to grab the opposite side. I just have to be careful not letting my knee go towards the floor. Pull the knee to the floor. Yeah, like that. I don't want that to happen. So I lean a little bit this way. Keep my elbow on his face. He has no chance to strike me. Once I get to the perfect position, then I can release and finish. Okay, so one more time, the real motion back up a little. He punches, boom, he postures, foot, triangle, push, control, then finish. All right, guys, enjoy. Please subscribe to our channel and like the video if you liked it. Thank you.